Hello and welcome to the show. I am here on Forza Horizon 4 with another challenge, well, kind of challenge slash police chase. Yes, I am going to be, well, I'm tasked with keeping the police busy around Edinburgh for 15 minutes. I'm going to be driving an Austin Healy 3000 while the police are going to be in the, well, kind of vaguely historically accurate Jaguar Mark IIs. Now, the Jags have got police lights on the roof and that's about it from standard. My car has been lightly modified for the sake of balance, a little bit lighter, a little bit more power in this vehicle. However, the important stuff is brakes, suspension, all of that tyres, all of that is standard, so it's all kind of 50 spec, which means there is no grip, there is no stopping. Corners are questionable and sketchy at best, although the same is going to be said for the Jags that are giving chase. So my goal is to survive for 15 minutes, which is not actually all that, uh, it's not all that easy, uh, considering my, oh, Apparently that did not... Uh, well, that's a good start. Yes, apparently I hadn't activated the chat thing. Um, we've got to stay within the confines of Edinburgh. We've got to try and stay within the confines of Edinburgh while fleeing the police cars. Christ, <laughs> that gave me a small heart attack right there. Bloody hell. That was unnecessary, I think, is what is what that was. Um... Yeah, I can't really go off-road. There's a couple of places where we might be able to go off-road around here. Uh, there's a couple of like, parks, areas, green spaces that we can dive across if needed. But I don't really want to. Oh, bugger. There is a Jaguar already. It's going to try and get stopped and turn around. Now, oh, I've not made that... Ah, this is the issue. You can see how there's a lot of difficulty for both parties involved here. The Jags, much like me, do not stop. They do not turn, uh, which, if they are coming towards me, they actually have a really tough time getting their car turned to give chase. Getting their car, you know, even vaguely make a make a pursuit out of it. Likewise, there, for example, I would have loved to have driven into the technical part of the uh, of, of the road. However, that didn't work. Oh, you're never going to make that corner. You've tried. I, I like what the thinking was there. Christ, there's a lot of Jags all of a sudden there. That one's going for a quick turnaround. Uh, yeah, I like the thinking of the Jags. They did a very good job of trying to cut me off, but you need such a long period of time to prepare for such a corner, even. You need a long period of time to prepare for in these. And their clever technique has actually afforded me a little bit of straight. There is no map. There is no names over players and so on. And while, of course, I cannot blend in to traffic, I mean, <laughs> this car stands out quite a lot. What I can do is if I break the line of sight, they can have a tough time. I think I just saw a police car on the top there. I think there was a police car up on that bridge was trying to figure out where I was going to be. Clever. Not helped them all that much, but clever nonetheless. Uh, we're going to get spat out around by Arthur's Seat. Now I'm allowed to drive around this part. I can go around the other side of Arthur's Seat if desperate. Um, I'm not at the moment. We might get there yet. Uh, I spotted a Jag. Oh, that's a narrow gap. I don't really want to try and fit through. But we're going to fit through regardless. And I don't really want to be cutting across. Like The Jags, the police cars will probably jump that bit of grass. I don't want to uh, because I'm worried about taking out the fences and start damaging my car. Now, they've got 10 Jags giving chase in, in this. Uh, and, well, if their car is damaged, they are out. You know, there is no repairing for the police cars, much like there is no repairing for me. However, there is one of me, and I break my car, and it's game over. They break one of their cars, and they've still got nine others to give the game over for them, but they've still got nine others to give chase. It's now pouring with rain. That's what we needed. No one has any grip, and you've now made matters ten times worse. Oh, bugger, that's a police jag. I spot up there. I know where I'm going here. They're trying to... I, I like the thinking. They're trying to almost get prepared for where I'm going to be. Although, I think, I, oh no, I've driven myself into a dumb place here. Uh, while my idea was solid. Ah! That's not what I wanted to see behind me. Go away. I've got more straight line speed than you, I think. Bloody hope I do. I'm in trouble if I don't. Okay, we are faster than them in a straight line. Yeah, there. <laughs> I, li I, like, I like the thinking's going on. We've got to try. It's just a, it's a tactical battle, this. Um, tactical battle between me and the drivers of the Jags. No, they're trying to prepare to give chase. Uh, while I'm frantically, desperately trying to figure out ways I can get away from them and just keep them busy for the 15 minutes. We've been going for probably not very long. Uh, or not as long as I would like to have been going. We've been going for three and a half minutes now. 
uh, which is, oh, that's a Jag getting ready to try and <laughs> give us a pursuit. <laughs> Quickly use this bit, use the straight line speed of the Austin. Uh, this is where I have the advantage. Oh, Transit's going to change lanes. That was a little dicey. It's fine, though. Yeah, see, now we got away from the scary bit. We got away from the Jags. Uh, we're trying to box us in on a little bit of a dead-end road. This is where we can we can make the most of the Austin's slight straight-line speed advantage. I wouldn't say power, because I think the Jags are actually slightly more powerful than this. But this uses its power uh, better than the Jaguars do. Let's try and make this corner here. That's not really a good racing line. That's really slowed me down. Are they gonna? Are they gonna have spread out? That is the question. If the call came early enough for someone to be able to dive down a turning, they might go for it. But I don't know whether the call will have come early enough uh, from that. I don't know whether they would have known. Doesn't look like they were in a position to do such a thing. Uh, I'm almost just doing laps at the moment around kind of some long straights of Edinburgh. Works for a little while. Won't work forever. Someone will cotton on to what I am up to. I say what I'm up to. I'm not intentionally doing this so I can get on long enough straights here. I can't really lose them in the corners as much as I would like to here. As much as I was hoping I could. Now, we won't have any observers up on the bridge. So, when I make a corner, I'm oh, not really far enough away. That's the annoying thing. Not quite far enough away. I'm glad I slowed down for that, though. Because that would have been nasty. Uh, let's go now. Here's a little bit more open. There's risks and there is rewards. It's a little bit more open, which gives me a little bit more of a chance. I'm desperately hoping there is a road I can dive off. Oh, that's not a road. I could have gone up there, though. That's given them a right chance to catch up. Oh, because I don't want to. I don't want to go around the back of Arthur's Seat. If we go around the back of Arthur's Seat, it means that all is almost lost. If we have to go around there, I know I'm in trouble. Oh, police car. <laughs> Oh, there's been an AI traffic collision. They've got distractoed by the shenanigans. I think that Jagnini took out the car giving chase. That's one of the real dangers they have uh, with trying to get their vehicles turned around. If they don't do it right, uh, they end up running into all sorts of trouble. Oh, just quick enough there. That was a big swerve. The leaning from my car, the leaning from their cars as well, if they have to do that at any point. Glad that Fiat was where it was then, because uh, that could have given us real grief. We're up to six minutes running away. Can we dive through here? Yes, we can. Uh, try and keep up momentum. Uh, any bit of momentum saved is good for me. Oh, that's a mini. I don't want to crash into that. We're running out of grip again. Jeez. <laughs> There's just no grip in this car. And the only good thing is I know they are struggling as much as I am. Like, I know they are in as much trouble when it comes to a corner as I am. One of the things you've actually got to be careful with these cars is the gearbox. Uh, you've got to really make sure you've held the clutch down. I don't know if I've done any gearbox damage while doing this. No, I've got away with it. Um, but yeah, if you don't hold the clutch down long enough, uh, you can actually destroy the gearbox. A few percent won't matter. However, when you start to get up to 25%, 40% perhaps. Oh, Jag! Did not even see there was a Jag behind me there. Um, I did not think there was one close enough. Last time I looked behind me, there was no sign of a Jag. Um, I don't know where uh, that one came from. It's going to spin itself off towards the wall. No idea where that one came from. Uh, that one there did a very good job of managing to find some pace. Popped out of somewhere. I am now poorly. Aero-wise, I'm wrecked. That doesn't matter. Uh, this doesn't <laughs> make much difference to the car. Done 15% steering and engine and... It's, it's unhealthy. Now my straight-line speed advantage is diminished. We're almost, almost halfway through, though. We've almost made it halfway through. Christ, this hill has killed a bit of speed from me. That was a sudden surprise jag. The good news is that one there is probably as poorly as I am from the hip and shoulder against the wall. But, um, oh, oh, there we go. Please take out your, t yeah, so yeah, that was, it, it realised it wasn't going to be able to make the turn. So it had to kind of stop and couldn't continue its turning around. Uh, we're going to dive down this way. I've still, I've got to go back to using the straights, I think. Uh, although now, now I'm in trouble because my straight line speed is diminished if you will. My lack of straight line speed here could be a... could see me well in trouble. We are now no longer doing the 120. We are still faster, but it's only just... What is our damage looking at? 15%. Okay, it's only 5% engine, which is good. The aero damage has been a lot more of a problem than I expected it to be. Uh, we're going to make this corner. Get the arse in. 
make sure that the jab... Like, you can't really torpedo with any real... Ah, they're trying. <laughs> they're being clever. Realise where I'm going to jump down. Now, I can still loop away here. With any luck, they can fall over one another a little bit. That would help out the Austin. Uh, we're going to have to... Oh, I can't remember where that... And that road, I think, leads us a little bit down a dead end, so I don't really want to go straight down there. Uh, they're leading. One's in the wall and taking out a <laughs> post. I mean, that's good news for me. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Is that That's some jags. That's some jags. I've got to panic and bail on that idea. All right, so apparently my arrow was more important for my straight line speed than I realised. Um, oh, that's a terrifying sight. There's too many jags behind me. Oh, I'm not making... That's a really nasty corner. But there's a lot of cars, jags in the houses... And uh, no, all the Jags avoided the house. Oh no, one went in at the background. Uh, <laughs> oh Christ, this is clinging on now. If I get any more damage, we're in trouble. I have a horrible feeling in a battle of muscle, the Mark II's will win. In an outright tussle of strength, I cannot push them away. And some of them, oh, that's just a random car. Ignore that one. That's just a, <laughs> that's, that's just a golf. That's not important it, to this chase, at least. Distracto, maybe. If we could distract the, the Mark IIs, that would be fantastic. Um, however, you know what? Yeah, just go and dis annoy the Mark IIs. Oh, that was closer than I would have liked it to have been. Didn't realise we were quite that close. To oh, sporting in transit. Well, we're committed to that. <laughs> it's just bouncing off the exit of the car park there. <laughs> Oh, make the corner, make the corner, make the corner, make the corner, please. The problem is I've got to drive in so deep to these corners to make sure I can't get hit from behind now. I've got to be a lot more acutely aware of what's going on. We're up to the ten and a half minute mark here, uh, which is good news for me. Oh, that was so close. That was very, very close to a uh, terrifying death. Trams. There are plenty of them around. The Jags, go and chase after the golf that's slightly ruining the uh, immersion of this one. Oh, that's a Jag there. Uh, I should have kept going on. I was committing to turning, just like slowing down for this corner. I'd already committed. Didn't have time to adjust, but I realised there was a Jag point in the way I wanted to go. Uh, thankfully, it doesn't seem to be paying all that much attention. So that will help me out here. Um, we are right on the limit of the grip. The only good thing is, as I said, so are they. No one's got any grip here as it's starting to rain once more. The sun is going down on, on well, on this day, potentially on this chase, if I'm not careful. Oh, the Jags have crashed into one another. <laughs> hey! <laughs> They've made a roadblock for themselves up there. They've really made a big old mess on that section. Thing is, we've still got three and a half minutes. I need to live. Keep going, little Austin. Keep going. To try and survive for a little longer now. I cannot go left here. They're going to have cars positioned ready. I've already done that manoeuvre a couple of times now. So I cannot take the first left. We'll run down here. I think this still gets spat out somewhere vaguely similar. But they won't know immediately. We'll be able to position exactly as they might have done in the past. Uh, so, yeah. We're going to be a little bit careful. Uh, don't go on that grass. Oh, no. I have, a bad, I have a bad feeling about this. I think I'm going where I shouldn't be going. Uh, and I think this takes us out of Edinburgh. Oh, uh, yes, it does. Crap. Okay, we need a new plan. Have a new plan. It's a really, really bloody dumb plan. Let's give it a go. Uh, Geronimo! <laughs> Got to get back into Edinburgh. Now, the easiest way to do this is on the motorway. I'm in the oncoming bloody lane, aren't I? Oh, never mind. It's fine. It's fine. We will... I can't go through the central reservation. Uh, we will head back towards Edinburgh. So we a roundabout that uh, can take us there. Uh, uh, this is silly now. This is silly. <laughs> Don't drive in the oncoming lane uh, with a quite poorly car. Good news is my little escapade on the... Oh, God, on the motorway has actually shaken all but one of them. I do fear the rest of them are going to be setting up some nice little roadblocks for me as we come barreling down into here. Oh, that didn't get turned. I thought that was going to get turned a lot quicker. It's kind of that double guessing of which way am I going to go, which way are they going to go. We're back on the run into the city now. Uh, oh, oh, that double guessing didn't go my way. There's Jags across the grass. I'm across the grass. I'm through a bus stop. It's fine. Oh, I'm back on the same bloody path, I think. Are we going to go around in a circle again? This was not the intention. Well, it kind of is the intention. The whole point of this was to distract the police. Oh, they nearly made a robot for themselves again. Oh, the fuzz are back. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Yep, I'm doing the round-around-in-circle bit again. Crap. Uh, 
Right, new plan. Understeer like a bugger, and we've got a minute and a half to go, and they've kind of fallen over each other a little bit. Uh, minute and a half to go. New, I'd say new strategy. Same strategy, hopefully this time better. Uh, <laughs> hopefully this time with less clinging on for dear life. Uh-oh. Nope, not the barrier. That's fine. We'll scrape it. We can just scrape the barrier. You can kiss the barrier, and that's all right. Um, now we... Hold our breath, they haven't, because they may well have got somebody up this end. You know, this is, this is the very, very edge of, of my area. We're back into Edinburgh now. We've got 50 seconds to go, and then we will have survived the Jaguar onslaught. I mean, we just need to be moving uh, by the end of this, and I think we will have been okay. I feel like we might have got far enough away, but I don't know if they've got anybody covering this way. They've got roadblocks set up on this bit. If they're trying... Oh, there's one! Oh! <laughs> that could have been the end. That could have been the end for me. Got it stopped just at the bottom of the hill. Will the uh, will the Jags be able to turn if they get down there? One slit, I think, into the wall. We will head back into the city. There's only a few seconds to go and not a Jag in sight. I think we will just, just complete our goal. Christ. We got looped around the same bloody circle twice. Uh, managing to do different things, though, has saved us, and there we go. It has ticked over, whoop, to the 15 second, the 15 minute mark, sorry. We have done it, and now the police can catch us, it doesn't matter. The other, no, not the other, I know nothing of any Sneakums heists going on anywhere else in Horizon 4 land. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Hello! <laughs> oh no, 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 don't, don't break the poor Austin. Just because I, just because I got, a, just because I kept going. You break each other. I should have just done donuts in the circle. I should have just done do donuts in a, oh, in a junction. Turns out that's quite difficult to deal with. Um, oh, hello. Uh, <laughs> there we go. Now they will finally pin us. It t they took their time. It will not matter though. For we have got away. We survived 15 minutes uh, before, well, being captured. But we did our job. We did our job. Um, I'm sure we will be promoted or something once we're out of jail in many years' times. A lot of vehicles were broken in the making of this. Including physics! Brilliant. Just just the ending we needed. Uh, so, <laughs> turns out it's terrifying. But, oh no. Oh no, what are you doing to me car? Uh, yeah, it turns out it's terrifying. It can just about get away. Uh, it is not easy, though. Just driving these cars at that sort of speed is tough. You've you got to think so far ahead. Good fun, though. <laughs> very good fun, indeed. That, though, is going to be it for this video. Thank you all very much for watching. Yes, I'm a cheaty bugger. Whee! <laughs> What's going on? We've broken physics to end. But my car's still okay from this. My car is... We've snuck out the other side to freedom! Yep, oh, that's a tree. Never mind, less freedom than I expected there. Slightly foliaged freedom, but freedom nonetheless! To freedom! Uh, thank you all very much for watching. Until next time, I don't think I can outdrag the Jags up the hill. No! No, my precious momentum! It has been scuppered by your sneaky tactics. Until next time, a uh, goodbye.